Hi, this is Johannes from Noisepad, and today we're going to show you the new version of Skyline. It's version 1.5, and what we have done is that we added a spread feature. And you may think that that's the same as the width control, but the width control is uh, just a mid side or some difference uh, volume knob. Why with spread you can up mix mono content to stereo, for example. And we're going to show you this today with three different tracks. First we have the Amen break, uh, a mono loop, and I'm just going to play the loop and start to do some adjustments. And you need headphones to hear this, these changes. So put on your headphones. And here we go, Amen break. That's just a quick demo of what you can do with mono content. Another thing we added in the new version is when you click something, you have a quick explanation of what the knob does. Um, see, as you can see, wherever I click, except for the solo buttons, we didn't feel that was necessary. We think you can guess what the solo does. I'm going to play the aim and break once again and I'm going to use noise but listen to listen to it in mono just to show you that it doesn't affect the mono compatibility at all. It's completely transparent when it comes to the mid channel. There we go. And you can also double click to uh, go back to the default position, however not. So that's the aim and break and let's listen to the next track which is a track that I made some early 90s. So it's really old. It's both mono and stereo content in the file. So it's not like the aim and break which is mono originally. Uh, I'm gonna start to play the track and let's see what we can do with that.
Let's play and check the mono compatibility. We use a stereo source. <laughs> So I, I used some extreme settings just to show that the mono compatibility isn't affected at all. It works perfectly. So I think with this particular track, if you were to do something with it, it's maybe that you could wish that the drums had a little bit more of stereo information. So that what that's what I'm aiming for um, with the settings. I'm gonna play it again and listen to the drums. And of course you affect other parts as well, uh, since it's a stereo with everything, it's not a mix, so... Um. And last I have... Uh, let's change to the right instance of the plugin again. And last we have a techno track. This is also made some maybe mid-90s um, or late-90s perhaps. It's really squashed, it's, there's no dynamics left. But I'm just gonna show you what we can do with the image, the stereo image of this fights too. And we're gonna try that in mono as well to see if it's still mono compatible. There we go. <laughs> And as always, when I do these demos, I'm exaggerating the effect to make it easier to hear what the plugins does. So, less is more. I hope you will like this plugin. It quickly became one of my favorite plugins for stereo imaging. Sometimes together with other plugins like Stage 1 or similar plugins. But Skyline is really powerful when it comes to quickly enhance the stereo image uh, in a non-destructive way. So, hope you like it and see you soon with the next plugin. Bye bye!